What's up, guys? Corbin, the cartoon character, is back again for another video. So today, I'm going to be talking about my favorite Cartoon Network show that I loved watching as a kid. Look, it's called Courage the Cowardly Dog. So, as you can see right here, there's Courage the Cowardly Dog, there's Muriel, and there's the mean old man, Eustace, that says, Stupid Dog! Yep, and here's the mask that he, that he uses to scare Courage, and like, oh, come on, come on, and then Courage got scared so much, and Muriel pulls out a rolling pin and then whacks him in the head with it. And he says, ow, what did I do? Mm -hmm. And here's all the villains right here. Like, there's the ghost head that just tells them to go away or they have to grow the plant if they want to keep their house. And there's freaky Fred right there that just shaves off Courage's fur. And then here we have the wear -a mole from that episode where Muriel turns into, oh, like, a wear -a mole that digs underground. Mm -hmm. And... There's the eggplant, there's cats from Cats Motel and Cats Candy, and there's Benton Tarantella, and here's El Lequack, all the villains right there. Mm -hmm. So, I really love watching this show, like, it just has like three different genres, like comedy, horror, and science fiction. Mm -hmm. It was <laughs> very, very funny, and it could be scary sometimes. It's very funny. I loved it. I just love watching the show. Mm -hmm. Like, this was very, very funny to me. And so when Courage of the Cowardly Dog was created by this guy known as John R. Dilworth, he worked the show. He created the show Courage of the Cowardly Dog. And also he has his own company, which is called Stretch Films Incorporated. Mm hmm. And what's even more sad, though, in 2020 is that Cartoon Network is not bringing back Courage the Cowardly Dog. No. Like, that that, that sucks even more. Mm -hmm. And, like, like this was this was part of my childhood. Like, it's not coming back to Cartoon Network. That, that sucks. Because, mm -hmm. like, I love watching the show Courage the Cowardly Dog. Like, this was part of my childhood. And, like, it was funny. It's scary. Mm-hmm. That's because they, like, they have a new program, which is Cartoon E2, for preschoolers and young kids. Mm -hmm. So they don't want Courage the Cowardly Dog to scare little kids. And so, I, I don't know. So, um, if you guys are a fan of the show Courage the Cowardly Dog, if you want to support John R. Dilworth, I will leave a link to his YouTube channel, Stretch Films, in the description below. He has done a lot of hard work on the show, and he does uh, lots of really great animation. Mm -hmm. So, to John R. Dilworth, if you're watching this, I just wanted to say that your show is really, really funny and great. You made me laugh and scared. Mm -hmm. And I hope that, that one day Courage will come back and <laughs> come back to Cartoon Network. Mm -hmm. So, what do you guys think? Are you a fan of the show Courage the Cowardly Dog? Or have you never heard of it? Let me know in the comments below. Anyways, guys, we'll see you all on Monday. Have a good day. Have a good night. Peace.